What's up? What's up, everybody? It's time for another video on the stupidest channel on the internet, Everything Bagel. Today, we're going to take a look at totally looks like comparisons between people or sometimes things that are not necessarily people, people and objects or whatever. We're going to see two things. We're going to know two things. Number one, does it actually look like whatever they say it totally looks like? And number two, was it intentional? Or was it just a happy accident? We got a lot more than actually I thought we did today. Anyway, let's, and you let me know if you think this is funny or not. Because if it's not funny, we don't need to do it. It's funny, we'll do it. Okay, okay, okay. I did not make these. Some of these people, I don't know who they are. So, just disclaimer, if you guys are like, I don't know who that is. Some of them, I'm like, I don't know who it is either. Anyway, let's take a look at the first one. What do we have? Larry David, I know who that is. That's the, he was a writer for Seinfeld, and he also has his own TV, well, had his own TV show. And Carlos, I get, I don't know who this is, Carlos Biaggi. It looks like maybe he's a, <laughs> it totally looks like he's a soccer coach or something, I would guess, because isn't that like a little soccer? coachy thing maybe I'm just guessing I don't know what I'm basing that on but he looks like you know, because it's not the, that's not the game angle it's not what does he look like as a professional it's, it's do they look like each other yeah they kind of do look like each other is it intentional no they're just, <laughs> they're just old white men. they're just old white guys speak for yourself bagel all right listen 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 by, by the way this is um cheese this is from cheeseburger the cheeseburger website if you want to know. Okay, next one. Top Al-Qaeda operative. I don't, I, I'm sorry, I don't keep a track of which ones are the which ones in Al-Qaeda. Uh, now this video is going to get flagged or something. I don't know. And Zach Galifianakis. They definitely look like each other. Was that intentional? Wait, which one came out? I Which one came out first? Like the, that, Is that from The Hangover or no? That's not intentional. They're both just... Have beards. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, I guess not intentional, right? Um, that's what I'm gonna go. Yes, look like yes. Same, si similar glasses too. Maybe that's part of the thing. Because if they just had beards, they'd be like, do they really look like each other? But um, same sunglasses. No, not same. Wolo Wizard from TBBT. What is a TBBT? Oh, the Big Bang Theory. Wolo. Well, that's his name. Is Wolo Wizard? Look. It says Walla Wizard. That's not his. Is that his name? And Napoleon Bonaparte. I had no idea that's what Napoleon Bonaparte looked like. I would say yes. I mean, I feel like we're going to say yes a lot for a lot of these. Like, they definitely look like each other. It kind of looks like Ringo Starr, too. <laughs> Maybe that was intentional. Uh, intentional. I don't think he was intending. I don't think the Big Bang Theory... Uh, Creators were like, let's make him look like Napoleon. Pretty positive that's not what they were thinking. Pretty positive that's not what they were thinking. Okay, next one. The Big Show. That actually does look, that actually does look like King Henry VIII. Yo. Why didn't they, why didn't they make that into his character? The Big Show. Why, like, for, for, for his wrestling character. That's what I want to know. He could have totally played King Henry VIII. No, that would be like, could you imagine if you were like a, a peasant in England and you were like, oh, well, the king is here and he's like seven and a half feet tall and like <laughs> Hulk smashes his fist to people's faces. I don't know, man. I would be very afraid of the king if that was if that was the king was the big show. Uh, okay. Guin from, I don't know what Guin saga is. Saga, 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 saga. And king from Tekken. This is this intentional? I mean, like, yeah, obviously, right? And then also, that's very that's very specific. That's not like just like, oh, this is a coincidence that both these guys grew beards and look like each other when they put the same sunglasses on. It's like, no, that's a that's a half man with the the head of a cheetah, and this in the same spot. That looks. That looks very similar, man. That looks too... That does not look like a coincidence. That looks like... That's like maybe intentional. I don't know what Gwyn Saga is, though. But, uh, yeah. There we go. I think... Maybe. Maybe conspiracy. Maybe conspiracy. Awesome beard, dude! Totally looks like apple pie. <laughs> I'm gonna say... First off, of course. Of course. 
wasn't intentional. Uh, was, did he wake up in the morning thinking, uh, I want to look like an apple pie? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'll let you guys decide this one. That does look like an apple pie, though. Okay. Uh, next one. What is this? Alice in Wonderland Tree. Never saw the movie. Sleepy Hollow Tree. Never saw the movie. Coincident. First off, yes. Definitely look like each other. Definitely crooked in the same, the same fashion. I want to make comments on crooked to the left and and slightly odd oh, shit thicker at the base and no 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 so stop stop talking stop the sentence there move on to the next sentence coincidence though isn't Johnny Depp in both of these movies maybe the casting de or maybe the art department was like Johnny Depp we <laughs> no don't say it don't say no I'm allowed to say it on this show Johnny Depp pull off your pants. We want to model this tree after your tallywhack out. <laughs> oh my god. And also, Whomping Willow, right? Isn't the, does the, doesn't the Whomping Willow look like the, from uh, Harry Potter? But Johnny Depp wasn't in that movie, so it must not look the same. Quite the same. I just assume now that this is what Johnny Depp's uh, pee pee looks like. Okay, well, uh, now we know. I think that's the... I think that's the... The, the, the factor that binds everything together in the universe. No, that's not. What? No. <laughs> no, no, no. Next one. This baby. What is wrong with that baby? And the Michelin man. Baby, you gotta stretch, man. What are you doing? It, they're so wrinkly. <laughs> they're so ro Not wrinkly. They're so roly. He's gotta stretch into that. Yeah, I guess. Well, wait a second. Is that why babies look all roly? Because they gotta, like, their skin starts out? floppy and then they like because they're gonna stretch so much like they're gonna grow so much that they don't want the skin to stretch I don't know is this like things that our body does that are like for smart reasons now you got me thinking well, I don't want to think this is not the channel for thinking okay that baby kind of looks like the Michelin man <laughs> a little bit what is the Michelin man you're supposed to be is that supposed to be white tires what is he supposed to be the Michelin man by the way you guys know when they say like Michelin star restaurants that's actually, it's, the, it's like the same company. The Michelin Man and Michelin Star, same company. If you guys didn't know that already. I already knew that for a long time, but I don't know if you guys knew. I, I, I definitely didn't just learn it from that baby's fat rolls, okay? <laughs> anyway. Uh, Jen did not, I have no idea what he, I, I actually thought that that was uh, Obi-Wan at first. Jen the Donna from Star Wars and Robert E. Lee. This is cannot be intense. I mean, like, if I was making Star Wars, I would be like, maybe model some of these, uh, some of these Star Wars characters after some historical figures a little bit, rough, you know, because you do research when you're when you're trying to make a movie or a game or anything. Uh, so I could see that possibly, but I think this was just coincidence. It's an old dude with a beard. This is just a coincidence, right? It just looks like it's a, just an old dude with a beard. Anyway, next one, next one, next one. McDonald's locations, okay, totally looks like myocardial infarction statistics. I would also say that this may also be like population density as well. <laughs> right. uh, I think McDonald's locations are just based on like population den density. However, it's kind of interesting until you realize it's based on just population density for the most part. Although people in California seem to be healthier. Did you notice that? California's like got a lot, a big population, but they're healthier. They got a lot of McDonald's too. But I guess maybe they, you, maybe, is, is McDonald's in California like very healthy? I don't know this. I, last time I was in California, I didn't even go to McDonald's when I was in California. I don't even know what I did when I was in California. Drank? I, I don't, probably. It's been a while. It's been a while since I've been in California. Anyway, next one, Scorpio from Star Wars: The Old Republic. That's what, that's what Swatar, that's what Sutar means. Star Wars: The Old Republic. Uh, totally looks like Maria from Metropolis, 1927. I mean, there's only so many different ways robot alien things can. That's very similar, though. Really, that's very. I would say that yes, this totally looks like that, with some different enough differences to not get sued. And number two, is it intentional? I would say, yeah, I would say it probably is actually intentional. That's what I would go with. I, it looks like it was actually like they were a fan of this Metropolis 
Um, and that's why. Maybe 1927? <laughs> really? Wait a second, really? Uh, anyway. That definitely lo does look intentional. Okay. Doug McFarland from Regular Show and Bill Lumberg from uh, Office Space. It doesn't say it, but it's from Office Space. Doug McFarland. Is it this also? First off, yes, it does look like him. Second off, this has got to be intentional. This has got to be intentional. What is a cartoon that parodies a lot of, like, movies and stuff like that? Trust me, I'm a big fan of cartoons. Know everything about cartoons. I should do a, 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 a South Park quiz or a Family Guy quiz or something like that. If I got e even one of them wrong, I would not be able to live with myself. Not be able to live with myself. But this is, I believe, number one, yes. Do, do, do's look like it. Do's look like them. And it also is actually intentional. Next one. I'm 100% positive it's intentional. Blake Anderson from Workaholics and Darth Microtransaction. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, d different, different, different. William Murderface from uh, Death Clock Metal Apocalypse. <laughs> that one. That one. Um, I don't know. Not really. They just got a, they just got a mustache with the thing in the middle, basically. I don't think that really looks like them. I'm gonna say no, and also no on intentional, right? I don't, I don't, I don't think really. Different hair, man. Different hairstyles and everything. Different attitudes. Different everything. Uh, next one, Rihanna totally looks like Jessica Rabbit. Number one, yes. In number two, intentional. This has got to be intentional. Rihanna doing that. That's got to be intentionally, intentionally trying to look like that, right? I would say that the red hair plus the the little the way it's like the the what is it like 50s style curvy curlies I think that that's actually intentional that she was actually trying to look like Jessica Rabbit. I know I know girls like to do the, like dress up like uh like s s icons or like like cosplay but like not cosplay cosplay whatever I think this was intentional. Yes, and yes intentional. Next one, this bread and chicken breast totally looks like the state of Florida. I'm gonna blow your mind right now. That is not a chicken breast, that is the state of Florida. That's the state, one is the actual state of Florida, and the other one is a map. That's what the state, that's what all these people live on is that piece of fried chicken. That's why, that's why Florida has so many problems, man. That's why Florida has so many problems. Uh, yes, those look, but where's Tampa Bay? That's, <laughs> I think this was uh, and, and, and another thing. Was this intentional? Maybe, maybe intentional. I don't know. Where's the Florida Keys? Do those just not exist? I don't know, man. I don't know. This chicken conspiracy. Will Poulter. I don't know who that is. Will Poulter and Sid from Tor that is definitely looks like that kid from like the the real life version of that kid. I would say yes. I don't know who Will Poulter is, but uh, that definitely looks like Sid from Toy Story. Is it intentional? Was this kid around before Toy Story? I don't think so. That must be just a coincidence. I don't think the kid is going to get plastic surgery to look like the kid from Toy Story. And I also think that Toy Story was around before this kid was... I mean, I don't know before the kid was, but I don't know how old he is or when Toy Story was created, but that can't be, like, Toy Story did not think, the Toy Story probably was like, let's just make a kid that looks like a kid, and then it happened to look like a kid, <laughs> a kid. so they did the job, basically. Uh, okay, there we go, what is this next, uh, did I just switch this around? No, I didn't switch this around. Jim Cramer from, uh, Crazy, Crazy Cramer, no, from, what is that, what are the, Mad Money, Mad Money. And Vladimir Lenin, they're both crazy. Listen, they're both crazy old men. Yes, one crazy old man with the mustache goatee. Uh, looks like the other crazy old man with the mustache goatee. Here's another thing. Does Vladimir Lenin, I, I feel like I look less like Jim Cramer, right? But <laughs> does Vladimir Lenin almost look like me? That's, now that I'm noticing that, I didn't notice this before, but... Um, Am I a Russian dictator? Probably. I, I probably am. I didn't even notice. Probably am. Anyway, I'm not bald, though. 
But we had a couple couple decades to work on that. Please, please let it be a couple decades and not next year. Okay. Uh, <laughs> it's 2020. It'll be by the end of this year. Next one, Nigel Mansell. Uh, totally looks like Super Mario. He's just a guy with a mustache and a hat. He kind of does, though. <laughs> that's, that's all Super Mario is. He's a guy with a mustache and a hat. And a smile. The little rosy cheeks. He, he kind of does. <laughs> okay, okay. I don't know who uh, Nigel Mansell. I'm assuming he is a race car driver because he's got the Texaco and Kmart and whatever. Dust Devil. He must not race anymore because I see a lot of companies that I... Like, Dirt Devil, like, is that even around? I don't even know if that's around. Yes, I would say yes, and not intentional. Not intentional. Lady Gaga totally looks like head. I don't know what Hedwig is. I have no idea. Rock Firepower. What is that? Hedwig and the Akinakarak? No idea. Maybe intentional. Maybe in Lady Gaga likes to take inspiration from a lot of different places. Uh, I'm going to go with yes. That does definitely look like each other. And yes, probably intentional. Uh, if Hedwig came out first, I don't know. Looks looks intentional to me. Next one. What is this? Mission patch. Yo. <laughs> okay, mission patch from what is this? Boeing and something, something, something. Navstar and GPS and whatever. Ula? Ula ask? I don't know what that is a mission patch from. But that definitely absolutely looks like a Transformer logo. Uh, yes, I would also say that was probably intentional. That was probably intentional. Maybe that mission patch came out first, and then the Transformers are like, yo, we gotta, we need a logo, and they were looking at different logos for, like, you know, different space program stuff, you know, trying to get inspiration. Like, oh, this looks, you know what, this looks almost like a face. Let's turn this into a face. And then that grew from that. I think, yes, this looks like each other. Yes, it was also Intentional. I'm gonna say yes on both of those. Uh, Kanye West hair totally looks like a. Oh my god. Uh, I mean, I kind of, but it's just like a bunch of mazes and stuff. Yeah, kind of, and uh, no, not intent. I don't think Kanye West is like. Let me be intentional. Probably, you know. I bet there's a lot of carpets that look like Kanye West hair too. Carpets in like Las Vegas casinos. This shoot totally looks like Sylvester Stallone. <laughs> like I said, some of them have are not even people, right? Uh, yes, intentional. Clearly intentional. Clearly intentional that Sylvester Stallone was mimicking the shoe when he was doing that. I don't remember what movie that was. Was that? That wasn't Dem Demolition Man. I don't know what movie that was. Listen, I don't know. You guys can let me know. But clearly, very intentional. <laughs> Randall Tex, see this one, it's the same murder face, right? Uh, yeah, this one looks more like actual, like, him. This one totally looks more like it. Uh, so Randall Tex Cobb, I don't know who Randall Tex Cobb is, but I would say, it looks definitely like Mario too. No, this one definitely looks a lot more like him though. A lot more like him. For sure. For sure. Next one. <laughs> Gary Spivey, psychic medium healer. I got a lot of things I want to say about this. So, first off, what did he do to his head? <laughs> Why is he a cute tip? <laughs> Second off, people go to him and say, I believe in what you have to say, Mr. Cute tip. Looks like Lime Cat and Lol Cat. Okay, I mean, obviously, obviously the joke is that they don't really look like each other, but they're both wearing stupid things on their heads. I bet, I bet if you asked him why he's wearing whatever the heck that is on his head, he's probably like, it protects my mind from the government trying to get in or something. I feel like that's just gonna be his answer. It's like to protect himself and his delicate mind or channel extra brain waves of something. I... What? <laughs> more, more realistically though, he was dropped on his head as a child and he wears that padding so it doesn't happen again. That's, 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 that's what I want to think. Okay, uh, and then Lime Cat. Who puts limes on cat's heads? I would do that. 
I would definitely do that. Okay, this water bear looks like, totally looks like a Volus from Mass Effect. Uh, is that really what a water bear looks like? What? Is that like a actual? That's weird. That's what they actually look like? That to that looks like it's manufactured for from something. It doesn't even look like uh, an actual like little microorganism, whatever. Looks like a false from Mass Effect. This could be actually intentional, you know, because a lot of these games working in the industry. Gotta say that a billion times just so you know that it actually happened. Uh, we we do draw inspiration from uh, from these different places, so maybe actually intentional. Possibly. Oh, that, it looks a little bit like it, right? It looks like a little bit like it. But, uh, yeah, it's crazy. I didn't play Mass Effect. I know, you guys hate me. The dislike video now. Now I'm back on that. Oh, <laughs> All the comments that I, I'm not going to make on this one. Jared Fogel totally looks like a child. Oh, I, uh, the angry video game nerd. Uh, I, I feel... I feel almost insulted for the angry video game. It's just a nerdy guy with a shirt and glass. There's a five billion guys that look just like this. I don't know if that's good or bad. I, I, that, it's a, it's a, it's a nerdy guy that doesn't have good eyesight. Uh, I'm going to say no with respect to the angry video game nerd. How's that? Riff Raff. I'm sorry, I need, a, I need a moment to process his hair, his haircut, and the things going on over here. You know what? That's almost like mine, but mine is not intentional. And Bono... No! No, 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 no. Listen, one has old MTV 80s neck tattoos, um, half shaved head and half corners. Here's the thing. What? What? They have the same... Tint of glasses. They have similar glasses. That's it. This is gonna be a no. It's not intentional. They have similar glasses and someone, someone on the internet is like, similar glasses, same person. I'm gonna start wearing Christina Aguilera's glasses and see if people <laughs> mistake me for her. I don't know. Ringmaster costume totally looks like pirate cast pirate captain costume. Oh my god, these lazy, lazy, lazy people. These lazy people that make children's costumes. That's the same that's obviously the same costume. But with a different hat and one of them has an eye patch. That's the same thing. Wow. Lazy, lazy a-holes. <laughs> really? Oh my god. They're like, well, we want to minimize the skews that we have on the... Yeah, yeah, okay. That's the same costume. Lazy, 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 lazy. Yes, it looks like each other. Yes, it's intentional out of laziness. Blobfish totally looks like this hat. Yes. I'm going to say yes. I'm going to say intentional. The hat is clearly mimicking the blobfish. God, that is an ugly fish. I'm sorry, fish, but, oh, I'm one to talk, right? I know, I'm, I'm, I'm one to talk, but still. So I feel like that's insulting the hat. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm just very, I'm very sorry about this whole comparison uh, in general. Okay, uh, yes, not intentional. Uh, Ringo Starr totally looks like the Burger King. Well, I mean, Ringo Starr came first, right? Wait, wait. The, the Burger King isn't like an old... Th I mean, like, I know Burger King franchise is old. But when did the Burger King start using this Burger King figure? I would say that, yeah, this looks... Uh, I mean, obviously, Ringo Starr, the Beatles were from decades ago, right? <laughs> but the Beatles were from 2013, right, guys? Yeah, I think so. What, what's John Lennon up to right now? The, I, 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 know, I know what he's up to right now. I'm very well aware. Um, yeah, uh, it does, kind of. Wasn't intentional. Good question. Maybe they were looking at different uh, king designs, and they're like, oh, you know, what was a good-looking king is Ringo Starr. Let's not make him look like an actual king because he would look like an evil, you know. And let's make him look like Ringo Starr because everyone loves the Beatles. Maybe this was intentional on Burger King's part. I don't know. 
It does kind of look like uh, they maybe modeled it after him. Maybe I'm just, uh, maybe, or maybe not at all. And, and I'm just pulling things out of my butt. Carol Radziwill, I have no idea who that is. And Steven Tyler. That kind of looks like it's like before and after cocaine. <laughs> that kind of looks like before and after cocaine. Does it, does it not? That looks like a before and after, like, like 10 years later. <laughs> I'm sorry. I'm, 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 but I'm not, I'm sorry, but I'm not sorry. They kind, kind of though. It doesn't even look like a daughter or something like that. It looks like it's the same person 10 years later. Okay, I'm gonna go with a yes and a not intentional, but before and after picture. Anyway, Snooky and a Cabbage Patch. That's definitely yes. And Snooky modeled herself after a Cabbage Patch Kid. She definitely uh, got cheek injections to look like a Cabbage Patch Kid for sure. <laughs> it makes a lot of sense though. Looking at it like this, it makes a lot of sense. Xbox One. Oh, Xbox One. And a pretzel bun. Intentional? You know. I mean, I'm... Uh, not intentional, right? Like, okay, it's just a meme, baby. It's just a meme. And then you think about it, like... No, it's just a meme, right? Xbox didn't, like, try to, like... Like, an open... I mean, like... I don't know. I don't know, man. I, 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 I just imagine, like, some board meetings or whatever, like, pitching different designs. It's like, what if... What if, and someone's got like a pretzel bun, like, yo, it could be a logo like this. Like, I don't know, man. I feel like this might actually, like, it's a stretch. It's a stretch, but maybe. Maybe. What do we have next? Hello Kitty Darth Vader. Oh, God, why does this even exist? And Pillow Mints. Totally looks like Pillow Mints. Why is Hello Kitty Darth Vader, why is that even a... Th <laughs> this video, this video is th almost 30 minutes long. Was this a minute that we go and look at every single one of these pictures? It must have been. Holy crap. It doesn't need to be 30 minutes long. Yeah. That definitely looks like pillow mints. And why? <laughs> and why? Why is Hello Kitty Darth Vader? Who is thinking? Please stop thinking. No. Please. Th Do I want them to say? Whoever made Hello Kitty Darth Vader. I don't know if I want you to stop thinking or think more. But whatever you're doing, do the opposite. Oh, do, do the opposite of whatever you're doing. Whatever it is, switch it around, 180. <sighs> okay, Darth Vader. Greedy King from Dora Saves the Crystal Kingdom and Ron Jeremy. I will never think of Dora the Explorer the same way again. I will never think of Dora the Explorer the same way again. I, I, I don't want to know. I don't want to think too much into this. I don't want to think too much into this. A little bit. A little bit similar. I don't want to think too much into it. Last one. Last one. Earl Hickey or, so Jason Lee, uh, or it totally looks like David Cr That definitely looks like him. That definitely looks like uh, Jason Lee. Half the time, Jason Lee just looks like that for whatever reason. Yeah, that looks like the same person. I'm gonna go with yes and uh you know Earl Hickey is not is not Jason Lee. It's a the character from um I forget the name of the TV show, but he's the character from Oh, my name is Earl. <laughs> Literally, my name is Earl. Uh maybe they could have you know gotten inspiration from other things, because when you're making a TV show. You do get inspired. You're like, okay, let's model this after this thing, this thing, this thing. So, possibly, or maybe they just like, yeah, grow a mustache, and then it happened. It, 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 more likely, it was like, hey, grow a mustache, and then he happened to look like David Crosby. I don't know who David Crosby is, but uh, I think I know who David Crosby is, but I'm not entirely positive. Anyway, that's a bit. It actually does look like each other, right? Anyway, that's it for this one. Saturday Night Shenanigans. We should do more than one video. I, I didn't realize we didn't do any other videos on this channel this week. I've been slacking. Slacking. I've been... Here's what I've been doing. I've been double uploading. 
uh, double uploading onto the main channel, right? Double uploading onto the big channel because, you know, things are crazy right now. And I'm like, we are not making enough revenue. We need to double upload every day. So I've been trying to double upload as much as possible uh, on there because the bird in the hand is worth two in the bush. You know what I mean? Anyway, that's it for this one. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I just do these videos for fun. Do these videos for uh enjoyment with you guys so that we all laugh together and be like what a very good thing is that silly uh, anyway hope you guys enjoyed it have the rest of a good rest of the weekend <laughs> I never thought. have a good rest of the weekend i will see you as always in the next one